Hello guys, my name is Rohit Kumar Thakur. So far in this Streamlight tutorial, uh, we have seen how to show the raw data, a map view of uh, where the most people get injured in the New York City and how many collisions occur at a given time of the day. Further we break down the data minute wise and plot uh, this with the help of a histogram. Now in this video, uh, we are gonna see the dangerous uh, street of New York City. Now in the data we have there are three affected type of people uh, cyclist motorist and the pedestrians so here i am using a selection feature of streamlight uh, with the help of this you can select uh, one option at a time uh, now for each affected type uh, we're gonna use the condition here for example in the pedestrians the affected people should be greater than or equal to one and we are looking for the street name and number of injured pedestrians then at last uh, we sort this value in descending order and here i need only the top 10 uh, dangerous street for pedestrians so at last uh, we use uh, colon 10 uh, you can uh, see that in the video now uh, the same logic uh, we're gonna use for the cyclist and the motorists too Now save the code and see the result in the Google Chrome tab screen. That's it for this uh, series of Streamlight. Uh, you have seen how you can use your data science python code and convert them into a web app uh, using Streamlight. It's a damn easy and fun to learn and I will be back with some more Streamlight series in the upcoming future. Uh, thanks for watching this video. Subscribe this channel for more project based videos on React Native, Python, Data Science, Django and Machine Learning.